everybody welcome back to the channel my name's mike and you're watching triple t acres and we are out here by my tractor i have an ls xr 3135 it's a 35 horsepower tractor and it just went through a regen process so i went ahead and started recording with my phone because you just never know when this stuff happens so this video is going to show you that whole process with my tractor going through the regen i put it right to work i didn't wait i didn't sit there and let it idle for no reason so stick around you're going to see the footage you're going to understand what that light is and what it looks like for a tractor to regen i hope you guys enjoy the video all right this is a regen it's just starting on my ls tractor this light right here is going to flash and the best thing for you to do let it run. I'm running a brush hog. You keep it just like this. What will end up happening is you're going to get another light here, and that's going to tell you your exhaust temperature is high. It's doing that on purpose. Once the regen ends, it should take about 10 or 15 minutes. You can just work as planned. Don't ever cancel a regen unless there's an emergency happening, like a fire or something like that, which brings up a good point. You don't want to do a regen around anything that could light on fire because of your exhaust. The exhaust temperature is going to come out very, very high. But either way, this is not an error. This is a regen. We just keep working. All right, here's that exhaust temperature light I was just talking about. That's just everything trying to burn off. Again, this is not an error. You gotta reach in, it always flashes first and it comes on steady. It's been about five minutes and now that's kicked on. When the regen is over, you're gonna hear the engine make a different sound and then that light will shut off and you'll be left with the exhaust temperature light on until it cools back down. We'll turn the video back on when the regen begins to quit. I wanna mention too, you don't have to stop working just because it's a regen. Why waste the fuel on a regen when you can continue to brush haul? So keep working. It's not gonna hurt a thing. And actually the RPM higher is gonna really help it. All right, so that is the regen process for the LS tractor. I'm recording this on my phone because you just never know when the regen process is gonna happen. And there's constantly questions on the internet about what the, what is this light on my dash? And it is a normal function for any tractor that has over 25 horsepower in the United States. It's just an emission thing. It's another thing the government puts on us uh, that wastes fuel. And you know we all have opinions about that, but that's beside the point. But it's not a big deal. Let the regen happen throttle up and continue to work. Otherwise, you're just gonna leave your tractor sit there and eat tons and tons of fuel. So not a big deal. I'll have to uh, I'll have to look back and see how many hours it was before mine went through. It doesn't feel like my tractor regens very often at all, but it's never been a big deal for me. So now regen is complete and back to normal functions. Guys, I hope that this helps you and I hope that you enjoyed that video. I know it's really loud, the throttle is really high, but I had to get the footage for you. So. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and until next time, we'll see you in the next video.